Just know that if any of this is posted online of any members of the public. Canada you Cop Watch. You guys can definitely see yourselves on there later. Canada Cop Watch. But in what situation could we be charged? For filming the How? If it's posted online. We were given the warning we can't film outside a courthouse and look who's out here filming outside the courthouse. Who told, who told you that? The police. The police are wrong. Where'd you get the stamps? None of your business. Where was your None of your that's, business. That's fine. It's none of your business, man. What kind of phone? None of your business. Where'd you get that? None of your business. Well, it's cool. I can ask. You. Yeah, I know for sure. It's none of your business, though. Oh, dear, way too close to my camera. What do you want, bro? The craziest cam back ever. This guy gave me a big thing. He told me Adams, and it's Kai Adam? Barkas. I said Adams. You're not listening to me. Yeah, why did it say so, Kai Barkas? That's another one. So you have two, your, you have two names. names. I'm not giving you shit. Not my name. You guys may be maybe videotaping them, you know what I'm saying? And now they're gonna be scared to come and testify. You guys should start being good officers to stop doing this stuff, man. This? Trying to tell people they can't film from public and intimidate them with body cameras, not identify, and should I keep going on? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm doing a documentary. If you guys wanna charge me for doing a documentary, that's what you're gonna do, right? It's none of your business. Just tell him it's none of his business. He, he's got a hundred questions. Legends, ladies and gentlemen, Canada Cop Watch. They were through North France, Percy, and uh, audited in Canada. I'm gonna go inside right now and try to get proof of the stay of my charges so I can go get my properties from 52 Division. Um, yeah, we'll see how it goes, guys. I have a feeling we're gonna get the runaround, but you know how that goes already. And we'll see. Sorry? You're not filming the inside at all, right? Can't hear you, boss. I don't need to be on I'm testing. Oh, dear, way too close to my camera. What do you want, though? I'm asking if you're filming the inside or the outside of the building. That's kind of a stupid question. Why is that a stupid question? Okay, let me ask you. When the camera is pointing right there, what do you think the camera is filming? I don't know, guys. You could put the camera either way, I'm sure. What do you want? How can I help you? I'm just asking if you're filming the It's none of your business. I'm in public. It's none of your business. Go to work. No, you're on private property. Go to work. Go to work. It's not private. It's public. She doesn't know that I already got, got to her batch number. Crazy. Calling him a moron, an asshole, Inside idiot. Here we go. Hello, how you doing? How you doing? All right. We're gonna speak to you guys. Just caution you in regards to some of the videotaping that you're conducting. Okay. Would you like me to come over here? Or? video recording as well okay so this is the court of justice act okay section 136 sub 1 okay and it basically is regarding people filming taking photography you can film me all you want i don't give a shit okay it's not, it's not gonna hurt me but there we're, is a we're, we're not here to hurt you by the way of any person in the building which the court hearing is to be and has conveyed and where there's reasonable ground for believing that that person for the purpose of attending or leaving the hearing, okay? You can't videotape other people in the public. The reason that they have this is because they don't want victims that have had like a heinous crime, like a sexual assault against them or a domestic assault. I'm just saying this. Feeling that you guys may be, may be videotaping them, you know what I'm saying? And now they're gonna be scared to come and testify against somebody that, you know, hurt them. We don't want that to happen. We're not here for none of that. I know brother. you're not, not but the here thing for none is, of that. Your presence could make them feel that way. Unfortunately, you know we're here working just like you're working. We're working on a story right now. I'm okay. doing a documentary that this building is a part of my documentary. Okay. And that's that. I know, but just this alone 
can potentially make victims scared to come and testify against a person that committed a really I can bad assure crime. you we're not here I to know, film anybody. I know, can, I know, I don't think can I are. speak? Yeah. I can assure you we're not here to harm anybody. We're not here to cause any sort of disruption. I'm here filing a freedom of information request with the clerk's office. Okay. So I'm going to be around the building until two o'clock. And I'm filming the docu I'm filming my documentary. Okay. That's it. I just want you to know that the impact that you could potentially have against a victim who doesn't know why you're here. You know what I'm saying? And maybe things that you might be filming here. I know what your intention is. Mm -hmm. I know that you're not here to do that. But if you do see somebody that may be apprehensive, that's a member of the public, we're not here to know, film them. Know, Definitely. I know you're not, but they don't know that necessarily. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So I just want you to be aware of the. Potential if I got impact. paid a dollar for Can every I time I didn't know something, I'd be rich. I hear you, brother. You know what I mean? So I if know. they don't know something, I, I, I feel them, but that's, that's but their that's problem, right? that's why this right? act exists, because we don't want victims to be scared to come and testify against people that committed really bad crimes on them, yeah. thinking that you may be intimidating them or that that person hired you to go film them. You know what I'm saying? I got nothing to do with that, I man. I'm doing a documentary on police know. corruption, so that's what I'm here for. All right, my man. All right. And just know that if any of this is posted online of any members of the public... Canada Cop Watch. Myself, you guys can definitely see yourselves on there later. Canada Cop will, Watch. Will, but I'm just saying that if any of these other people are... It's all going to be posted. Not, all of it's going to be posted. You can Canada face, Cop you Watch. Can face potential charges as well. Brother, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm doing a documentary. If you guys want to charge me for doing a documentary, that's what, what you're going to do, you right? Well. This guy gave me a big thing. He called me Adams oh, and it's Kai Adam? Bartis. I said Adams. You're not listening to me. Oh, yeah, why does it say so, Kai Bartis? That's another one. So you have what's two, your, you have two name? names. I'm not giving you shit. Not my name. And this, this word shit that you guys are trying to pull, this is for in the court. It's a joke. It's, not for yeah. it's a joke. Yeah, it is. It's a joke. What do you want to say? I want to say that this exists. We protect victims. I don't care. I have so business. Oh, no. We're working. So my rights don't mean shit because somebody was a victim of a crime? Like, fuck. It's a joke, man. It doesn't look good on you, man. I don't give a We're shit. Trying you're trying to tell you me guys. I can be charged. You and and you and you, you're laughing. That's great. I love it. Yeah, it but you know what? Way. This this doesn't work this way. I'm not looking at your insults to me that you may have to work somebody else. I don't care. I really Sir, are you the are you the feelings police or are you law enforcement, man? Just answer that. Feelings or law? Are you here to like invoke feelings? Feelings or the law? Because I have every right to do that. Every right. And I don't care. If a victim is a victim, big deal. It does, you know what? So when, when, when CTV's out there, when CTV's out there, you guys are going to see What's your name? I want your name. Yeah, guys, can you identify for this this camera, please? And your name? 10961, what's the name? I never see nothing. I can't stop if you're gonna not if you're gonna make me read it. What's the name? If, I just want to see the name. It doesn't intimidate me, man. We pay for them cameras. I'll freedom. I'll freedom information request all of them. It doesn't. It doesn't intimidate me, man. Yeah, it's called intimidation. Yep. That's called intimidation. Yes, it is. You're trying to intimidate. How am I trying to intimidate? What are you guys using? I have a camera too. Camera mic. Everybody does this. None of your business. It's on public property. Right? None of your business, man. Oh, iPad. Where'd you get the stand? None of your business. Where was the iPad? None of your that's, business. That's fine. It's none of your business, man. What kind of phone? None of your business. Where'd you get that? None of your You're business. Well, it's cool. I can ask. Yeah, You're I know for sure. It's none of your business, though. You guys should start being good officers and stop doing this yeah. stuff, man. What are we doing? This. Trying to tell asking, people they can't asking, film from public and intimidate about, them with body cameras, not identify, and should I keep going on? I just asking about your film equipment. I'm just having a conversation. Just be a better officer, man. The relationships with the community yeah. are so much better. I love the community. The community doesn't do love you guys. The community don't love you guys, man. I don't I mean, mean to break it to you guys, but you guys... You don't, you don't speak for the whole community, I'm sorry. I, I speak you for a lot of speak, a lot of these people out here. I get a lot of opinions. Anybody here? Through our page, we get a lot of opinions about you guys. They can say it, but you can't put words in other people's mouths. I, I right? just, I'm just... That's their right. I'm just telling you what's read. That's their right. I, what I read, man. What kind of phone? It's a phone. It's none of your business. Phone, just tell him it's none of his business. He, he's got a hundred questions.
You guys be better, man. Be better cops, guys. Like seriously, man. I don't, I don't, you guys don't have to do this. This intimidation shit, it's the wrong one though. You guys are trying to win the wrong one. You're trying to intimidate Canada Cop Watch right now. Like what's wrong with you guys? I hope all you guys are safe out there. Oh yeah, we're gonna get somewhere else. Get them on in the same video since the cops are out here threatening people that they shouldn't be filming. CTV is filming right outside the courthouse. Well guys, this is how it goes. We were given the warning we can't film outside a courthouse and look who's out here filming outside the courthouse. Oh, yeah, they just told us we're not allowed to film out here. Who, who, told, who told you that? The police. The police are wrong. Yeah, I, under I agree with you. We ain't gonna be interrupting your story, guys. We're just, uh, we just wanted to get it on camera that we are being treated differently. Cam back with City TV, that's crazy. This is the craziest cam back ever. The craziest cam back ever. I was set up by Toronto police for filming them. So I'm here submitting a freedom of information request. Got it, okay. I have to be here till two o'clock. We just happen to be out getting footage while I'm documenting this process. Okay. And this ha we were just told we can't film outside a courthouse. Okay. We seen you guys filming outside the got courthouse. It. So okay. we just wanted to capture that moment. Thank you. Okay. And when we came here, we got a little bit of a weird reception from you guys. I didn't think it was That's all, that's, that's where just, we're at. You have to understand, I'm, you know, I get people shouting things at me when I'm working. Yeah. I get nervous that's sometimes. Not, that's not what we're here for, and, though. And I appreciate I would that. protect you if I seen somebody I bothering that. you or hurting Thank you. you. I honestly, from the bottom of my heart, I'm, and I love that you explained that to me, I understand what you're doing, and I understand that you needed to get us there to show that media are doing that, too. So I told Sometimes it's just a conversation. Exactly. Right. Exactly. You have Thanks a great day. You, too. Thank All you right. so much. Are you, getting, Bye. are you getting your paperwork? Yeah, at 2 o'clock, I got to go back. Sorry? Three times if you want. So how are you supposed to know who's a victim and who's not? Right? I guess that's up to you guys. Well, I'm just the, saying. Like if that's the part of the I'm not the one filming. That may be policy. questions you no, may want to figure out. I'm just trying to understand the policy. If that's, your, if that's your policy, if that's the policy, like who's a victim and who's not, right? That's just a, that's a bit of a conundrum there. And obviously you wouldn't be charged unless we're able to prove that you're filming a victim, right? But that's why this is here, because they don't want victims to feel intimidated about coming into a courtroom, because they feel like the person that assaulted them or sexually assaulted them hired you guys to intimidate them, because they don't know what's going on here, right? That would be assuming that we're on some criminal shit, though, man. To, to, just to assume that for someone filming is ridiculous. To, feel, to assume that we're here to do some illegal stuff. The, the assumption alone is ridiculous, though. It's not, it's not a fair assumption from somebody coming in a uniform looking at the public. It's not fair, man. You have to retrain your brain. To feel intimidated coming into the court. Yeah. You have to retrain your brain. There's cameras everywhere. Look, I could point anywhere. I'm going to find cameras anywhere. Look, bang, bang. What's the difference with this and them? That's not going to be posted on the internet. That is. And you guys don't care, which is, which is fine. It's not that we don't care. It's that we're in a city full of people. And when we're doing a story, we can't tell the city to stay inside for our story. You understand? I hear you. The police corruption don't stop in the city, bro. So when we're doing a documentary on police corruption and you guys are doing this on the documentary, it's crazy. It's crazy. And you laugh. That's the even crazier part. You're laughing at it. You, what's crazy? Tell me what's crazy. That you're laughing and you're telling us we can't film 
on a documentary that's called I, Charter I, of Rights I, I, Under I, I, Attack. I'm not telling you you can't film. And this is what you're doing yeah. on the documentary. You don't I get that point? You, did I tell you, you, couldn't film for it. you said I could be charged for it. Don't I shouldn't do it here I if I post it. Blah blah blah. That's what you did. Victim leaving the building. You can be charged for filming a victim. You can be filmed for filming. You can be charged for filming a victim. No, you can't. And I was just saying you can only be charged for filming a victim if you got some ill intent and you're gonna do something. With that, because you will be arrested. So I, I have tons of, of victims coming in and out of the courthouse every day. Of course, you have tons of criminals too. Yeah, exactly. and, and and their names end up on the news. But it would just so, be a. Tell me, how, how, to how would you? For how, human how, or, but, uh, you can't do that. You can't do that by you, violating you my rights. Take them, them out. I'm not violating your rights. You're well, free to stand here. Oh, tell me, we're going to be charged if we film. I said you could be charged if we film. In what in what situation could we be charged? For filming a victim if it's posted online. It says right here. Yeah, I'll give you the paper. If what's posted online? Can I get the paper? Oh, yeah, you can do it. I wouldn't arrest it. But there are pieces like that. What you're about to read me, I've already heard you say it. So My it point is, so the, the difference is, if we were here to intentionally film victims and interruption... No, it's not. Of course it does. You can't say a dash cam that got a victim on their camera just committed a crime. That's ridiculous. You guys are intentionally filming directly outside a criminal For business. nothing that has to do with anybody going in know, here. It's for my business. I'm filming for okay. my business. You guys clearly don't care. Okay, you've made that very clear. You know why I don't care? Because you guys so are corrupt. You're allowed to film here as much as you want. Okay? You guys are dirty. The reason I'm here is because you guys set me up. The reason I'm freedom of information request because your dirty partner, James Bragg, is the one that arrested me. The one that got caught watching porn in his car? A warning about some of the details in this next story. A Toronto police officer facing discipline amid allegations he watched pornography in a squad car and even chased a female colleague. It's being recorded too. Does that familiar? Does that familiar? That's you. Anyways, you can be on your back. I'm being arrested, my people. I'm being arrested. No, I mean, it's public, man. It's being harassed, man. Jay Bragg and the number. What, what is this what intimidation? Not at all. I'm in public. I didn't commit crime. I don't identify to you guys. Ignore that part. Your dirty partner, James Bragg, is the reason that I have to come here and do this. I love how he ignores it. I, I would ignore it too if James Bragg was my partner. I would ignore it too. Anything else, guys? You have any other miseducation you want to spread out to the world? Why you guys to have a safe day? Same thing about filming victims. We're not here to mess with victims. I'm not saying you are. And I don't think that's your intention. Hello. Who are you? Excuse me. You're on live, just so you know. That's fine. Right now you're under investigation. I'm putting you under investigation detective. Do your fucking job. How about I am. That? And I'm warning you. Don't warn me. I'm not your fucking child. Pull your mask down, tell me your name, and you can walk away, or you can videotape us. That's perfectly fine. But right now, I'm investigating for someone that videotapes us all the time that has two active warrants out. Now, you can tell me your name, or you can What, what are these warrants for? Okay, you're putting handcuffs. Is that familiar? Is that familiar? That's you. Anyways, you can be on your back. I'm being arrested, my people. I don't answer questions. Do your job. Figure it out. Watch yourself, man. Watch don't fuck step on my foot. Don't step on my foot. So if you work with us, we can work with you. I don't work with kids.